it's a little bit right now it's a risky and because the people they uh, looking you in your cameras and they're asking you, you know, stopping you you know uh, even the local people and the police and all they disturb you before that and when we travel you know and in 2004 six and seven eight to the to the different provinces the people was just you know really interesting you know interested to to talk with us, you know, st standing in front of the camera, I'll take my pictures, you know, laughing, you know, looking at our cameras and they asking how we became, you know, like, you know, photographers. Uh, in the past, actually, journalists were kidnapped or arrested or harassed for, for something, but right now, uh, they simply get killed, you know, they don't give you a chance to, to talk to them or, you know, you know, be arrested or be kidnapped. So it's getting worse and worse every day. And just a few minutes before that, the Marai was just, we was in touch, you know, just chatting on WhatsApp. How is the situation? If you need, you know, help, I want to come with you. Normally, we want to do the same, you know. We have to uh, tell a lot of untold stories right now because we see the world is, is a mess. And uh, the international community has almost forgot in Afghanistan. There are a lot of other issues that we have to, we have to address. So there has to be somebody, there has to be at least a team, there has to be some people to kind of continue catching attention of the international community toward Afghanistan. <laughs> 